Wowzers! Who ordered a sandstorm? I can't see a thing. Giggy! Spino! Are you there? <laughs> well, we can still hear them. The sand is settling. But wait! Is that Spino out in front now? It is. Spinosaurus has taken the lead. <laughs> She's launched herself into the lake. I didn't know Spino could swim. She's even got a sail like a boat. <laughs> well, Spino's sail is a bit of a mystery. Some think it's just for show. Others think it keeps her body cool. And some even think it's like a camel's hump that stores fat. So it's not for swimming. Don't get me wrong. She can certainly get around in the water, but it's unlikely she was a full-time swimmer. I think she's less like a super croc and more like a reptilian river bird. Aw, oh, that's way less cool. Not at all. I reckon she's at her deadliest in the shallows. Look, here she goes. She's cutting across the lake while Diggy's stuck going the long way round. She's got an enormous advantage here. By going across the lake, she's cut her course in half. Let's check in with Giggy. Oh, gee, that looks tough. She's showing real grit and determination, but it's going to be hard for her to come back from this. Well, you'd think so, but as we know... Anything goes in the Dino Dome. Hang on. Where did Spino disappear to? There, in those reeds. She's way off course. What's she doing over there? She's so still, like a statue. She's focused on something in the water. Uh-oh. Oh, that's what steered Spino off course. A juicy sawfish. Spino's favourite meal. Spino has a bunch of small openings on the tip of her snout to sense moving fish. Spino, there's no time for fishing. You've got a race to win. <laughs> I would have expected that behaviour from Giggy. What do you mean? Well, she's big, but not so bright. But she's like a super-sized T-Rex, and everyone says Rexy has a big brain. Not Giggy. She's big everywhere except the brain. But Giggy's head is enormous, the length of a tall person. But her brain? Only the size of a banana. Ladyfinger or Cavendish? <laughs> I'm a Mesozoic master, not a fruit fanatic. Oh, well, I can't tell Giggy's brain is tiny. She's focused and right on track. And with Spino snack time, she's closed the gap. She's entering the maze and... <laughs> slammed into a cactus. Ouch! For more Titanosaur twists and turns every Thursday, ask your grown-up to download the ABC Kids Listen app, free from your app store. Or look for Kids Listen on the ABC Listen app. Catch you there for more... Dino Dome!